You're invading Cassie and Chuck's house for Thanksgiving this year, right? 100%. That's yeah. right. Well, we're living, so we're building our house, which typically we always do kind of our family Thanksgiving at our house, but we're in the process of building our house. So we're living in a rental house right now. And uh, Jason, when you say house, Shut up. I know. When you build your house, just when stop. you say house, Shut literally, up. when there's a battle between like the Opryland uh, water park over here and you for the guy that's going to come to the backyard, that's a, it's going to be awesome. Oh. But Chuck, did, he's been he's been mentioning this. He's like, yeah, well, we live in a bigger house than Jason and Brittany. So it's like, just makes sense to do it at our place. Well, live, we're living in, in Kane Brown's old house right now. So uh, for free. For free. Yeah. Well, <laughs> Wasn't that wild? So, so this is like a guy that opened up for you on tour. Kane yeah. Brown. Well, you know, Kane just bought a new house and um, and he had a house that he was trying to sell. And, and so, you know, I was talking to him one day and I said, man, I wish I'd have known you were buying a house. I would have. I'm paying rent. I'd rather pay it to you. And, and, and plus he lives like very close to, to Chuck and, and Cassie and, and w where we were was, I don't know, probably 30 minutes away or so. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, I was like, man, I wish I'd have known. I would have just paid you for a while, you know? And, and he was like, man, just move in. He's like, <laughs> I don't care. Just move into my house. And so, uh, so we moved in, in his house over there a couple of weeks ago and, and, uh, we're going to stay there until our house is built, but it's, it's cool. Cause we're like, now we're 10 minutes away from these guys. It's and, nice. Yeah. But it's and, like all his stuff still there. Like, is he oh, no. I mean, well, he had some stuff there and I called him. I'm like, dude, you got like a pool table in the garage. You got like you know, your clothes, there's like suits hanging on racks and you got brand new tools that you haven't even opened. Like I went in his garage. I'm like, man, you clearly just took what you wanted and moved and left all everything else over here. So he, he actually came over there and I guess he went through what he wanted and took it and had somebody come clean it out.